The Xbox One X is just weeks away from a launch and a little longer, locally, but already the power differential between it and the PS4 Pro is being picked apart in recent releases. Shadow of War is one such example, a game that is full of intense details and massive draw distance that bring even the most powerful PCs down to a crawl at high resolutions. The Xbox One X then should put in a good showing, and Digital Foundry found it to exceed expectations. There are two key differences here when you take Microsoft and Sony's two best consoles. The PS4 Pro already puts in a good showing with Shadow of War, hitting around 1620p and injecting improved visual settings with the game overall. It's a dynamic resolution that changes too, but one that also struggles to load good textures in. Memory is to blame here, and it's where the Xbox One X's 12GB of GDDR5 comes into play. Loading 4K texture packs is no issue for the console, and, even in early games com build of the game shows a massive leap forward in visual quality via textures alone. Resolution then only services to widen this gap, and the Xbox One X features some interesting configurations here. Unlike on the PS4 Pro, dynamic resolution scaling can actually be turned off here, which pushed Shadow of War to a native 4K 2160p. From there you can enable settings that prioritize this resolution or visual quality settings, with Digital Foundry actually finding the latter to be the better option. In fact, Shadow of War has so many visual options that a dynamic resolution with all of these dialed up makes for a better experience, but having the ability to decide is neat. Simply put, the Xbox One X is managing to hit 4K at a mostly solid 3.0 FPS with a bunch of high-end visual settings turned way up, making the difference between it and a high-end PC almost negligible. There is isn't a PC on Earth that costs nearly close to the Xbox One X that could output what's happening here, which is really the head-turner in this story. PC might offer a better experience overall if you have the money to pour into it, but the Xbox One X is standing so far well ahead of the pack in this bracket. There's much more to dissect when the console launches, but this is a very promising start indeed. Last updated October 20, 2017.